think what we're doing. My, my dudes. What we're gonna do soon. I know, it's like a slight remix of it. It's like the usual remix, but it has like more like mm, to it. <coughs> oh god. Hello! Hello, hello. Oh, we gotta edit that shit, huh? But dumb. I don't remember how to stream anymore. Ha <laughs> ha. How to stream? A three. Uh, eh. Done. Huzzah! Huzzah! Everyone can see? Just gotta turn up. I gotta turn. Yep. Gotta take this uh, further down. Oh my. Oh my potato chips. Yay! Everyone can see! I'm glad. Hello! Hello, honey! Hello, Pagazuka! I don't know who else is here, but hello! Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. What happened? I'm so excited! Things are gonna happen. Uh-uh. Okay, this. Oh, I got no load game. This is a new game. Oof. Okay. God. I don't know if I'm ready. You unlock a special reward. Load demo version. Save data. I don't have the demo. You're crazy. I don't have no demo. I don't have the demo. What is this? No. Which voice language do you want to use? English. Because we're used to English now. <laughs> mm, what extra? Uh... Hmm. I guess we'll play all that stuff later. Hey, subtitles on? Wait, subtitles is always on. I lie. Let's go! Oh no. Normal. Normal. Let's go. Everything's normal. We don't do... easy. Oh. And this is how this starts. It's Monokuma! Oh, this is all of them. What? And anime. Spare girls will forever. What? Oh yeah, the anime. I remember. It was so sad. <laughs> it was so sad. Story is not over. Oh. A new killing game will begin again. Ah, oh, awesome. Cool. That's ominous. People gonna die. Team Dagon Rumpa. Hey! Killing Harmony, B3. Sniffle. Nothing. No light, no sound. No form, no voice. No knowledge of who I am. Who am I? Who am I? I extend a hand, a hand that belongs to no one. To take hold of my existence. 
Oh, I'm a cute girl. What happened? This is me. Hello? I'm a cute girl. What happened? My name is Kaede Akamatsu. I'm good, Bakazuka. How are you? I just remembered who I am. Tea is hot. Can't drink it yet. Help me now. Nice to meet you. Kaede Akamatsu? Is that someone? I'm the protagonist of this crazy story. Kaede, isn't that a name I know? Ultimate Revival. I feel like that's a name I know. Whole lot of dots. More dots. He stumbled out of the locker in a daze, but as soon as I did, wow, this gr the graphics are so good. <laughs> They're so shiny. I stumbled out of the locker in a daze, as soon as I did, I fell on the floor. <laughs> I couldn't even brace for impact as blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. Uh, but thanks to that pain, I went from dazed to annoyed real quick. Wait, where am I? What is this place? I rubbed my throbbing forehead. Yep, this is definitely gonna leave a bump. I looked around. Oh. Classroom? Yeah, this is a classroom, alright. But I don't recognize it. Oh, is this a dream? I just have to pinch myself, right? So I pinched my cheek. But all that did was make my head hurt in two places instead of one. Um, um okay, hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end I just couldn't. Blam! Whoa! Suddenly the locker next to mine started swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noises. As I fearfully turned around, the locker door slowly opened and... <gasps> A boy came steadily out. A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. In fact, he might be a high school student too. He looked bewildered when, and when he slowly lifted his head. Ah, I screamed too. Ah. I don't know if the sound for the game should be louder or not. Just tell me. You guys can hear like the voices from the game and also from me, I guess. <laughs> also, this is a cool. If you look over there, like the music is going off. Wow, that's so cool. Anyway. Ah! He screamed as if he'd just been uh, as if he'd just seen a monster fell on his butt and scooted away. Or scooted back. Uh, who are you? Are you with those other guys? Huh? What other guys? The people who kidnapped me. Um kidnapped? Wait! Where am I? What are you gonna do to me? Hey. Uh, hey, hold on. I firmly gripped his shoulders. What's your name? Huh? Huh? Uh, uh, um... I'm Suichi Saihara. Yeah. I'm Kaede Akamatsu. Nice. Now listen to me, Su 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 Suichi. Suichi. Whatever. Got it? Shut up. You're not the only one who's confused right now. Huh? Uh, sorry. After making him shut up, I retraced my steps again. That's right. I was kidnapped too. I was walking my usual route to school when all of a sudden someone shoved me into a car. I shouted for help, but no one came to rescue me. Everyone pretended like nothing happened. It made me think how rotten the world is. And then I lost consciousness. That's right. 
And when I woke up, I was inside that locker. Huh? Same with me. Were we kidnapped by the same person? Or same people? Oof. It seems like it. Jeez. But why me? My family's not rich, and I'm no one special. I'm just a normal high school girl. There's no reason to kidnap me. Uh, okay. Me either. I'm just a regular guy. And this is a school, right? Why did they take us to a school? Um, I wonder why. Hey there. I'm sure you're confused right now. You're thinking, where am I? Now listen to me, Sushi. It's Suichi. <laughs> I, I feel like, like, it's like Shu Ichi. So Shu Ichi. Yeah, okay. I'm just getting confused. You're thinking, where am I? Well, I can't explain that, but I can give a basic explanation about the controls. Move your mouse to, uh, move your mouse. Move your mouse to control the reticle on the screen. When you have a target in your sights, left click to investigate it. Hold down the right click and move the mouse to adjust your view. You can also press the space bar to smack objects around. Who knows? You might find something amazing. You can always press the Q button to return objects to the original position. So relax. However, not every object can be moved. Thank you for understanding. If you press the enter key, a mysterious investigate power will activate. Sorry, I know this is a lot of information. Investigate this place thoroughly. That's how you progress the story, okay? You should fully investigate this area first. Well, shit, I can hit stuff? A space? Smack! All the smacking. E. 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 Get out of here! Uh -uh. Get out of here! Just get them all out of here! We don't need no school stuff. School is lame and I want all those Monokuma coins. I'm sorry. Get it. Get in my way. Yeah, go through between you. There we go. Eh, it's right there. Uh, thank you. God. Hmm. Oh, sure. Well, I can't snack anything else. I don't know. Press enter, I think it was. Whoa, everything's glowy. Was it? No, it wasn't enter. It was, uh. Not space. Oh, that? I remember. Whoa! I remember how to return it back. <laughs> I just forgot. This is weird. Okay. Okay, they, they made this different. Okay. <gasps> you can still use your mouse. What was this? Recycle. Okay, let's check the windows. The outside of the window is covered in greenery and barbed wire? Where are the school windows covered in barbed wire? Q to reset? Yeah, it was Q. Let's check out the locker. We woke up inside of these lockers. Oh, why were we in these... Why were we in these lockers in the first place? Um. Anyway, let's just stay calm and think. I'm sorry I shouted at you earlier. No. Uh, no. It's okay. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Hey. Anyway, this place is weird. You don't think we got caught up in something bad, do you? Uh. Something bad? What's going on? What have we gotten ourselves into? Who the heck knows? Hey up! There's a blackboard, there's lockers. Is this a monitor? Nothing's being displayed right now. Seriously though, what is this? What is it? It really seems out of place here. Mm. I see the door. Can't go up, we can, but there's nothing up here. And nothing to slap either. Okay, let's look at the blackboard. That's a blackboard, right? Every classroom has one, but this blackboard isn't also an LCD screen. That's something you don't see every day. 
Okay, well I've checked everything, right? Press enter. Yeah, I've checked you all, except for you. Where am I? Why was I kidnapped? Who kidnapped me? I don't understand this at all. But that doesn't matter. At least for now. Hey, let's just get out of here as fast as we can and find some help. Uh, yeah, good idea. We ran as fast as we could to the classroom door and opened it with all our strength. But then... The fuck? Hell yeah! Found you! What is this? What? A, a monster? <laughs> this is bad. We need to get out of here. Why is there robos here? Uh, okay. Hello, Sane. Wait, 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 <laughs> oh. over here. Oh my god. What? I can run? What? This is weird. Ah, shit. Don't go that way. Over here. Oh, this is so... This is not great. No, 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 no! Oh, jeez. What are those things? It's like they mix things up. Ugh. To the gym! Oh my god, I'm so scared. My poor little hands. As we frantically dove toward the door, we saw something we never expected to see. Oh, more people have arrived. Oh no. The thing is, I really have to put this in here. And then, like. <sighs> I'm like, no! Now this brings me flashbacks to Despair Girls, and Despair Girls, like, freaked me the hecky heck out. I'm just like, no. <laughs> I don't want this again where I probably have to, like, run away from things or whatever. Whatever, okay. Huh? Did you all get chased by that monster too? Uh, oh, yeah. What are they? What do they want with us? Do you want me to check on what's happening? You can't! It's too dangerous out there! It's likely that monster still lurks nearby. You never know if you'll like them in the future, though. <laughs> Wait! I shouted at the top of my lungs. Who are you guys? And why am I here? And that makes 16. What? I'm talking about us. There are 16 of us. All high schoolers. What do you think that means? Sixteen high schoolers? <gasps> Sixteen. Ooh, such a lucky number. All right. Didn't answer your question. My name is Rantaro Amami. I can give you my name. It's Rantaro Amami. I'm sorry, but... Let's leave it at that for now. What? Um, uh, okay. You know... Anyway, why does it matter if they're- Cat! Cat! Shut up, cat! God! Anyway, why does it matter if there are 16 of us? There might be more coming. No. No, I don't- I think this is all of us. Shut up, cat! Bite you! Oh, with hair flicking your nosy! Anyway. No, I think this is all of us. If this is what I think it is, anyway. What? If ah! Destruction. She always does this whenever I'm streaming. What the heck? Anyway. If this is what you think it is. Hey! What? You some kind of fucking know it all? If you know something, spit it out. Oh, she's angry. It was at that moment, an unknown voice suddenly echoed throughout the gym. Okie dokie. 
Okay. Quiet, everyone. Shimmy down, shimmy down. Hmm. No, no, it's shimmer. It's simmer down. What? Oh, no, there's voices. Huh? But they're not Monokuma. Huh? Who's that? Where are they? Then the hecky. Thanks for bearing with us. Are you serious? Damn it. There are more monsters. We're surrounded. Ah. These aren't monsters. They're exosols. And that's that. They're highly mobile bipedal weapons platforms. Weapons. Should we take these for a spin by killing one of them? Uh, wait a minute. It wouldn't be any fun picking on plain good for nothing commoners. <laughs> You're right. We should at least think of an interesting way to kill you. Well, maybe I'll pick you up and squeeze you till your guts come gushing out like toothpaste. Wait! <laughs> Please, not like toothpaste. Oh, I just imagined it! I can't handle gore! Well? Then what if... we start peeling off their limbs one by one, like string cheese? Ah! Please! Not like string cheese either! Ah! Wait... We can't kill them with the Exels. Or Exesols. Whatever. According to the schedule, the Exesols aren't supposed to show up till later. What are you saying? But... We're in the Exosols right now. Ah. Oh, so we are. Hmm. We screwed up. We're not supposed to be the Exosols for our first appearance. I told you we should have read the script. What are you saying? No, you didn't. Hmm. Well, why don't we just get out of these mechs? It shouldn't be too late for that. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Shadow. Okay, ready. There's so many voices. <gasps> Monotoro! <laughs> oh no! Oh, I love this song. Oh. Dots! Huh? Hey. See, we're out of our exosols. Now we're not scary anymore, right? Right, right? Aww. His desperation is strangely terrifying. You, you punk asses better brace yourselves. And he's just outright terrifying! Right. Now I'm a messenger from hell, from the depths of hell, here to drag you down to hell. Hey. No, no, Mona Kid. You're saying hell too much. It's ruining the hellish impact. What's hellish mean? What? Hey, what's up with these stuffed animals? How are they moving? Seeker, hello! I, I have no idea. Moving stuffed animals. On top of that, it seems like they're calling themselves the monocubs. Moving stuffed animals? Monocubs? Oh wait, you guys call yourselves the monocubs? No, don't bother asking Monadam. He only talks to close friends. The years of abuse have really done a number on his heart. Isn't that right, Monadam? Monadam, you won't even open your heart to me? Looks like I was right. This is exactly what I thought it was. But who's behind all this? Why the ridiculous re theatrics? No, let me just drop this way. Ugh. Shut up, you. All of you are reacting way too normally to this. It's boring. Actually, don't their clothes seem kind of boring, too? Wait a minute. You think maybe they haven't been given their first memory yet? Huh? That should have happened before they woke up. Hey, answer my question. If you guys are Mona Cubs, then... Hey! Who the hell are you, punks? Huh? huh? What do you mean? What? We're just wondering, do you guys have ultimate talents or anything like that? 
ultimate talents? I don't have one. I have a skill that I devote myself to, but I wouldn't call it an ultimate talent. <laughs> Me either. I... I don't have anything like that. N yeah, same here. I knew it. They haven't gotten their first memory yet. Monofane. Weren't you in charge of that? <laughs> All the dots. I'm gonna go sleep now. <laughs> She's sleeping. Did she really? Did she seem really tired to you guys? She's obviously faking it. Zzzz. <laughs> Even if she's faking, she looks so peaceful. Let's whisper so she we don't wake her up. <laughs> if you say so. Anyway, if you guys are really the Mana Cubs, then <laughs> don't worry about us. The real issue is your is these bastards. Well, issue is putting it lightly or mildly. This is actually a huge problem. You guys all have uh, forgotten your talents and become generic high school students. Huh? Forgotten? See, according to the backstory, there's this ultimate hunt going on. You've all lost your memories and become different people because of the ultimate hunt. Um, what are you talking about? Well, in your current state, it's pretty much pointless to talk to you guys about this. The first thing we need you guys to do is remember your true selves. Yeah! You need to reclaim your sealed talents by regaining your memories! What? what? Uh, are you awake already? I don't get it. What are these sealed talents you're talking about? Oh my god, Blood, I said that there were <laughs> Oh my god. How are we supposed to talk when you keep asking so many freaking questions? Yeah, we're not some so swift footed singer who's landed another future ex boyfriend. It's okay. Yay, blood! Let's do this already. No one wants to watch a bunch of generic high school whiners. Right. Verse will update your wardrobe so you guys look all cute and spiffy. Oh my god, clothes! Oh my god, really? <laughs> Magical transformation, let's go! Everyone's transforming. Wow. We all have clothes. Huh? <gasps> Sing, thank you for the bitty. Magic girl, it up, baby. You right. Uh, uh, what? What am I wearing? Mm -hmm. Looking good. Now you look more like ultimates. The ultimates, really? So... Next up, the memory you've all been waiting for. Hell yeah. Hell yeah! Get ready. Once the seal's broken, we'll be in the domain of the killing game. Killing game. All right. Now then, after the flashback light helps you remember your amazing talents, this amazing story will begin for real this time. So long. Get Friend. Ah, light. Chatty name. Piano. Wow. Do you want to save? Fuck yeah. <laughs> I'm confused. What just happened? Save. It's so cool. Ultimate revival. I know, it's super cool. What? They restarted it? Huh? Uh, huh? I stumbled out of the locker in a daze. But as soon as I did, I fell on the floor. I couldn't even brace for impact as blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. Oh my god, we're restarted! But thanks to the pain, I went from dazed to annoyed real quick. Huh? huh? Where am I? What is this place? I rubbed my throbbing forehead. Yep, this is definitely going to leave a bump. 
I looked around. A classroom? Oh no, it is deja vu. Yeah, this is a classroom, all right, but I don't recognize it. Where am I? What am I doing here? Ah! Oh, is this a dream? I just have to pinch myself, right? So I pinched my cheek. But all I did was make my head hurt in two places instead of one. Um, um okay, hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end, I just couldn't. <coughs> Whoa! Suddenly the locker next to mine started swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noises. As I fearfully turned around, the locker door slowly opened and... A boy came stumbling out. A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. In fact, he might be a high school student, too. He looked bewildered, and when he slowly lifted his head... How oh, rude! Don't freak out at me like I'm some sort of monster. Uh, sorry. I'm sorry too, okay? I just have no idea what's going on. But all the more reason why we need to stay calm. Oh. Uh, Gymnopathy Number One by Eric Sadi. Yeah, that's right. Try to remember that sorrowful me me uh, melody filling your head and soothing your heart. What the heck? Uh, oh, teddy bear? Oh, no, it's a monster. You can freak out about this. She was talking to you. That's so mean. You humans are the real monsters for calling us monsters. Although if we were monsters, at least we're pretty monsters. Okay. I agree. I'm glad I was born with these looks. I definitely won the genetic lottery. Huh? What are they? Why are they talking? Aren't they just stuffed animals? We're not mono cubs. We're the stuffed animals. Psst, mono kid. You're saying the lines backwards. No, stuffed animals, s. The monocubs, them. Oh, jeez, it's even worse now. Huh? Monocubs? Oh, you've heard of us. N no, of course not. I've never seen walking, talking stuffed animals. As soon as I said that, these monocub things started looking at each other and... Yay, it worked! Phew. Had me worried there for a second. Um, uh, hey, worried about what? I don't understand what's going on. Okay. All right, now let's tackle each issue one at a time. You're so damn reliable, Monotato. He's like a sixth grader helping out a fifth grader. Which means we should keep our expectation reasonable. Well, what's your question? I have a load of questions, but for starters... Where are we? This looks like a school. Okay, so this place is called the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. Ultimate Academy? Well, I've never heard of a school like that. That's right. Of course you haven't. This school was made for you 16 Cretans. Huh? 16? Right. Yeah. There are 16 ultimates at the school. Huh? huh? Ultimates? Well. You know what ultimates are, right? The government scouts them through this program called the Ultimate Initiative. Actually, ultimate basically means you're practically prodigious in a particular talent. Basically, the Ultimate Initiative exists in cultivate t uh, to cultivate talent throughout the country. Promising students are eligible to receive all kinds of special handouts. Like free school tuition, voting privileges, eligibility to run for elected office. They even get granted. They even get grant money too, right? That's right. Students chosen by the ultimate initiative are known as ultimates. Hell yeah! Hell yeah. Students would do anything for the honor of being a chosen ultimate. I don't need the explanation. I already know, because I'm an ultimate too. 
That means you gotta remember this time, so don't forget anymore. Yeah, forgetting about your ultimate talent is such a waste. Huh? huh? What do you mean, forgetting? Shut up. Shut up. Quit your yapping and get started already. Huh? Get started with what? Why exploring this academy, of course. Well. Also, you should introduce yourselves to the other ultimates. Because you guys are all gonna do an activity together later. Awesome. I've got a rager right now. Well done. Bearwell. So long, Bearwell! Uh, they left. But I still have so many questions. Hey. This isn't a dream, right? No, but I wish it was. Uh, anyway, we have to find a way out of here. But I said there are 16 ultimate students here. Does that mean he's one too? That was very strange. You are very correct, sir. Well, guess we gotta do this all over again. Hush, smack! Oh my god, they have coins in them again! Urgh. I want all the coins! Slap them! Hold on, I'm not done yet. Eh. Need all the money. All the money! Each bear pun will drain life points. I don't know about that. That'll be interesting. Hit all the things so they don't deserve it. Eh! Come here! So much more. There's still, like, one more. Watch up! Okay, well, let's look at all this stuff. The outside of the window is covered in greenery and is this barbed wire. Covered in barbed wire. Look at that on too. Oh, it's a classroom. What happened? Is it press enter? Hmm. Oh. This one spider now seems out of place here. You look up inside these lockers. In the first place. I guess we'll talk with this boy, Mr. E. Um, are you an ultimate student too? Uh, yeah. Well then. I'm Shuichi Saihara. They call me the ultimate detective, but... <gasps> He's an ultimate detective! Shuichi Saihara, ultimate detective, Dabs! Huh? What? You're a detective? That's amazing. No. Uh, no. I don't have the credentials to call myself a detective yet. I just happened to solve a case that ca came across, and now people call me that. Not many people can just happen to solve a case. You should be more proud of that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Kaede Akamatsu. I'm the ultimate pianist. Nice to meet you. Ooh. Kaede Akamatsu. Ultimate pianist. Dabs. The ultimate pianist? Pianist. Um, well, no one calls me the ultimate pianist. Usually just piano freak. I can't speak a piano freak. Ever since I was a child, I would play the piano whenever I got bored. Oof. There were even times I played the piano so much that I would forget to eat and sleep. Man, that sucks. Eventually, I won trophies from concerts, and people started praising me. Woohoo! That's how you got your ultimate title? And that's way more impressive than me. Burp. No, that's all I'm good for, really. Yeah, I like his uniform, too. We still have to see the other ones. <sighs> now, this is my first time meeting another ultimate student. Well, ultimates are scattered all over the country. They're difficult to find. Um, Even so, there are 16 ultimate students gathered here now. But why is everyone here? Were we kidnapped? If so, then, is some organization out there trying to kidnap all the ultimates? Hey. Uh, about that. I don't remember. Huh? Oh, you don't remember? Uh, um. I've been trying to remember it, but I can't. No matter how I try, how hard I try. Oof. I have no idea how I got here. When I woke up, I was in the locker. I don't know how I got there. It's like that memory just fell out of my head. Same here. 
can't remember anything. Even though I'm trying so hard to remember. Ooh. What happened? Uh, are you okay? What's wrong? No. Oh, I'm fine. I just got a headache. That's all. But it can't be a coincidence that we both don't remember. What happened to us? Um, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. Probably not a big idea. Or not not a big deal. We're confused. We just need to relax. Is all oh, let's just imagine Maurice Ravel's on a time. Is that music? I don't really know much about music. I see. I see. That's unfortunate. When we get out of here, I'll share it with you. Oh, right. But first, let's look for a way out. And if there are other Ultimate students here, we should talk to them too. At least one of them has to got to know something. Right. Yeah, good idea. Hacho, obtained friendship fragment. Whoa, we got fragments here. You can leave a room by pressing the escape key or interacting with the door. There better not be anything spoopy out there, because I'm gonna be like... No. Even though it's a hallway, there are sure are a lot of plants growing here. And the air here is heavy. Oppressively heavy. How's it forcing you to recall your fears, smothering you anxiety? But this is just a school, right? What kind of school makes you feel like this? Huh. What's the matter? Uh, I just felt something in the pocket of my uniform when I looked. Remember. I found this inside. It's some kind of mini tablet computer. Oh, maybe I have one too. I knew my backpack felt heavy. Heavier. Um, the word monopad is written on it. When did this get in my backpack? My name was displayed when it booted up. Like a student handbook? I don't know what it could be used for. But I don't think we should throw it away. Let's just hold on to them for now. Yeah, yeah I agree. Congratulations! You can now use the monopad. Press the F key to open the monopad. You got tons of uh, game information in it. Stuff like report card and map. Be sure to check it out. And if you got a sharp eye, you may have already noticed. By getting closer to your fellow students, your report card will be updated with content. Since you are now acquaintances with Mr. Saihara, his information has already been added. And I bet you've also already noticed you can level up by performing actions. When you level up, your skill slots increase, so you can equip more, even more skills. There are a lot of skills, so view them in the report card. If you want skills, make friends. Strengthen your bonds. Be sure to test out all the skills. Also, there's one more important thing to tell you. You can save and load the game from the handbook. Make sure you save all the important stuff. Well then, off you go. Find your classmates. But what if I want to explore? Hojo! No, I can't hit that. Guess I have to find them? Huh? Oh, wait a minute. Is this a music room? Huh? Oh, it won't open. This room does look like it was made for me. Oh god. You're so small. Raise and shine our sign. Uh, they're here again. What do you think this place is? Hmm. Check out all this fancy schmancy writing. Seems like a place for eggheads. Huh? Isn't this an ultimate research lab? What the hell? Why would you tell them? We were trying to make it dramatic. Uh, oh, I see. I'm sorry. Huh? huh? What's an ultimate research lab? Yay! We want you guys to keep honing your ultimate talent, so we set up these rooms for you. This is the ultimate pianist lab. But we set up labs for other ultimates too, of course. Well, actually, Most of them are still well hidden, though. Um, By the way, the reason this research lab is still locked is... Is... Because we're still setting up everything. Sorry, we'll host it to get it all ready. Wipe your asses and wait. Damn. The hell you 
That's good advice and all, but don't you mean to say hold your horses? <laughs> Monikid is such a dummy. What are you laughing at? I'll bully you like I bully Monodam. <gasps> Vexio, hello! Um, it seems like the music room, but I guess it's an ultimate lab. Hey. Do you think there are really other rooms like this for everyone? I wonder about that too. Anyway, I thought this was the music room. Oh, I really wanted to play the piano. Oh well, I can play as much piano as I want when I finally escape this place. That's weird. Ooh! There's a dragon here. What is this? It looks like a dragon statue. But why is there a dragon statue in the school's hallway? No. I... I have no idea. Hmm... Maybe it's part of the school's official art collection or something. Still no idea. It's even more awkward because the stripes plus name make me think Stefani from Lazy Town. <gasps> Stephanie. Um... Hey! You're an ultimate student, right? Can we talk? Um... Hmm... Did she not hear me? Okay then. Hey! Hello! Uh... What? She still can't hear me? Maybe she's a really detailed mannequin. No, I don't think that's the case. You never know. We already saw a moving teddy bear. As I said that, I poked her cheek. And felt her skin... And felt her skin squish beneath my fingertip. Uh... Poking her doesn't work either. Then maybe she is just a doll? But she looks so real. Try it, Suichi. Poke, poke. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> just do it. It's so fun. As I grabbed his hand to make him poke her other cheek. I never thought I'd be poked from both sides. How truly unexpected. Uh. So she wasn't a mannequin. Well, I knew that. Wait. Oh, if you knew that, why did you make me poke her? Because she wasn't responding. No. Oh, I didn't mean any harm. I was just deep in thought. So I thought if I ignored you, you'd go somewhere else. Oh. You were ignoring us? Isn't that a bit rude? Um, well, it isn't rude to force someone to talk when they don't want to. Oh, but it's fine. I feel like talking now. Right. Now let's talk. What do you want to start with? Right, right. My favorite Doraemon episode is number 53. The one with security cameras and target practice. You know? Um, before you talk about that, can you tell us your name? Hmm. Oh! Ultimate cosplayer! Poker with something else, wow. Sugumi Shiragane, ultimate cosplayer, dabs. So you're a cosplayer? Are you surprised? I get that a lot, since I'm so plain. I mean, it sort of makes sense. You have this strange, almost sexy aura about you. I bet it's because you've got people oogling all your curves on a daily basis, huh? Kaede, you sound like a creepy old man. Normally, I don't like, really like people looking at me like that. Actually, I just like making cosplay. I'm fine with others wearing them. But lately, more cosplayers are putting themselves before their characters. You're right. I'd rather wear my outfits myself with love than give them to people like that. Wow, you're pretty intense. Oh. It makes me happy when I get to show people that out the outfits I've made. And thanks to my sponsors, I can use materials that are just plain expensive. Oh, well, of course the ultimate cosplayers would have sponsors. It's not a big deal. People just crowd around like I'm a panda at a zoo. That's so amazing. You're pretty much a celebrity, you know? Uh, is it alright if I ask you something too? Earlier, you looked as if you were thinking hard about something. What was it? Oh yeah, we needed to ask her that. Nice job, Shuichi. Oh, that bronze dragon statue over there. I'm just plain curious about it. 
It almost seems like it's floating, right? Doesn't it look pretty out of place? Yeah. Now that you mention it, you're right. It sort of bothers me too. And this is a school, right? But everything here is so weird, isn't it? Nearest trees and grass growing inside. I can't find any exits. And it seems like we're the only people here. Actually, are we going to be okay? Are we going to be able to get out? Um, Kaede, what's wrong? Uh -huh. <laughs> that frightened look on her face was sort of sexy. <laughs> this again? <laughs> well, I'm just kidding. Well, it's not a big deal. My present situation is our main concern. Once it's over, we'll be good and dandy. I see. You're pretty optimistic, Kaede. Mm. Well, people do say I'm carefree. Yeah, that's right. Worrying won't get you anywhere, you know. It's better to just be carefree. Yeah, yeah I guess so. Being all depressed won't help anything. Yeah. yeah, so let's try to find a way out. Obtain friendship fragment. Sugumi's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Depths. Uh, it also has one eye. Let's talk to her again. Yeah. Hope anything. Yeah, trying to see the next con is coming up. What should we do? <sighs> That's right. What am I gonna do if I don't finish my outfit in time? Cosplayer. I feel you, cosplayer. I understand your pain. Why? Because I've been there too many times before. No, nah, she wants to make hers from scratch. That's the type of cosplayer she be. Hello, A2! Girl's bathroom. This is the girl's bathroom, right? No. Suichi, do you mind waiting here? Uh, um, sure. D don't give me that weird look. I'm just gonna check if there's anything inside. I doubt there'd be an exit, but just in case. Uh, sorry. Into the bathroom I go! Hopefully I don't get murdered. The toilets seem normal, but it's weird that plants are growing this thick. Pacha. Pacha, 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 pacha. Ooh. Pacha, pacha. Yeah, I can't do anything. Press enter. I guess this is the only monitor. Monitor is way too high tech to be used in school. Oh, I guess there's nothing here. Excellent. Ciao, Charlo. Hello. Would you like to leave? Yes. Who the hell is eight tube? I don't know, but I see one. What the heck? Oh, I leveled. Okay. Boys bathroom. Hmm. This is the boys bathroom, right? I, I can't go in there. Not even this situation. Oh, um, uh, if you want. I could go look. What? I'm not that curious about what's in there. Remember. Well, this is an unusual building. Anything could be in there. Wait a here a minute. Pretty good, actually. With that, Suichi opened the door and walked inside. Dabs. It was just a normal bathroom and nothing... Ugh. G <coughs> it sucked. It was just a normal bathroom. Nothing out of the ordinary. No one was inside. I see. I see. Some of my friends. Messy! <gasps> you changed your name! That's so weird. I now have to get used to this. That scared me. Maybe detectives live for these kind of scary situations. Man, I wasn't scared yet. I got scared when there's things trying to chase me. There's stuff over there. You can't go over there, though. Can't go in there. There's another classroom. Classroom A. Oh, there's people in here. Hey! Hey! Wait for me! Stop. 
Please stop. Don't come pull any closer. That boy in the white clothing is chasing that other boy in the funny clothes. What's happening here? Be back to Messi soon. Oh, okay. Well, let's see who all these people are. Come on, wait up! Let me touch your body a little. I've always wanted to be friends with a robot. Huh? What? A robot? What is it? What is it? Are you another robophobe? I have a recording function. If you make any robopho robophobic remarks, I will see you in court. Hey. Wait, you're a robot? Are you for reals? A robot? No. Are you one of the monarch cubs? Do not compare me to those toys. I am not just any old robot. I am K1B0, the ultimate robot. But please, address me as Kiba. He sues Boopus people. <laughs> K1BO! Ultimate Robot! Um, or Kibo. Ultimate Robot? That's not fair. I can't be the only one who gets to show off. I'll reintroduce myself too. Or introduce myself too. Uh, um, go ahead. I'm Kokichi Oma, the ultimate supreme leader. Kokichi Oma, the ultimate supreme leader? And then Daps. A robot? And Supreme Leader. Neither of them make any sense. By the, way. By the way, I learned the hard way that a robot's breath smells like gasoline. My breath does not smell like gasoline. I am powered by electricity. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. You're not funny. Of course you don't think I'm funny. Robots can't understand human humor to begin with. Do not mock D don't mock me. I have studied the complete history of stand-up comedy. I think you should have just watched stand-up comedy instead of studying it. Plus, I may have it, the appearance of a robot, but I am a high school student just like you. You're a high school student? Yeah. I was created by Professor... Profes professor Itabashi, the leading authority of the field of robotics. He installed in me a strong AI, capable of learning and maturing a human brain. That's why at the time of my creation, I didn't know anything. I was like a baby. But the professor raised me like his own child. He taught me so many things, until finally, he enrolled me in high school. How about this? And now I stand here before you all. See, I'm just like everyone else. Hey, hey do robots have dicks? Hey. Please do not ask ridiculous questions. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> I only asked because your backstory is pretty flaccid for a robot. <sighs> Honey, thank you for the biddies! Protect his booper. Let him sue the boopus. He might just die. <laughs> I don't believe in anything. Well, I can see how a robot might be enough to be called the ultimate robot. Um. Hey, Kokichi. I don't really understand your ultimate supreme leader talent. Oh, I'm just the supreme leader of a se of an e evil secret organization. That's all. Huh? What? Um. I gotta say, it's pretty impressive. My organization has over 10,000 members. Seriously? I'm the supreme leader of an evil or secret organization. I'm a liar. Who knows? I am a liar after all. Huh? Huh? So you were lying just now? It's true. Well, I am the supreme leader of an evil or secret organization. That part was true. Please. So, were you lying or not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not telling you. Hey. Uh, by the way, what is the name of that organization? Uh. It's a secret, you know, because it's a secret organization. But I've never heard of such a large secret organization like that. Of course you haven't, because it's a secret organization. Hey, everything he said so far has sounded like a lie, so that's gotta be a lie too, right? Just leave him alone. Everything he has been saying has been a lie. He's a far more suspicious person than I am, that's for sure. Well, of course you're not a suspicious person, because robots aren't people, silly. Oh, you mad? Are you gonna hit me with a rocket punch? I don't have that function. Aw oh, man, you're boring. What a weird kid. He's like a mischievous little kid. Or a weird boy. Eh. I guess there's no time to be joking around. Unless he really is an evil supreme leader. Obtain friendship. Kokichi and Kibo. Report cards have been updated based on your experience with them. 
Devin. Let's talk with Cookie Cheek, because he's weird. He might be an ultimate liar. Who creates a robot without a rocket punch? Why do you even exist? I may have the appearance of a robot, but I am a high schooler just like you. From one high school student to another, I hope you can all get along. You're so good! That's a six burn body. Whoa! Aw, Meanie! This blackboard is also an OCD. There's something you don't see every day. It says Meanie! It says Meanie! Also, I want all them coins. Time to do my usual thing. Get me some coins. Get me coins. Sorry, I'm slamming all the things, cause... And I respect no authority! Authority! Do not respect all. Screw all this classroom stuff! Pew 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 pew! Give me all the Monokuma coins! Ugh... Only one of those whoopy... Like Wally or Chappy. Maybe. You never know, we'll see how it progresses. You never know, you might actually not like him as much as you do. Same with the cosplayer. You might not like them as the story progresses. Let's talk to Suichi. An evil secret organization with over 10,000 members? Hey. It's a lie. I don't think you should worry about it. Hmm. That's true. Yep, you never know how these people will be. I feel like I missed something. Let's go back over here, because I feel like I missed something. Let's go down here. Over here. Oh, there was more! I knew it. I knew there was more of you. Mystery! You was given a different character sprite in the demo, which is pretty cool that they hit that. I wonder if they switched around other characters and sprites. They might have. Oh, hey there. You guys get kidnapped too. Well, you both look alright. That's good. The situation could be better, though. Yeah, totally. Hey. hey, let me ask you something. Do you guys remember how you got here? If you're asking us, then you don't remember either, do you? Huh. <laughs> You're the same way too, huh? You don't remember anything, do you? I guess that means everyone here is the same. Huh? huh? Everyone? No. I asked the others too. They all said they don't remember. So the others don't remember either. It's like we all have amnesia or something. But... Ah. But that's normal. Oh, I'm dying. <coughs> Yeet! Whew. Oh. But well, that's normal. If everyone here has amnesia. Well, I guess we're all in a pretty abnormal situation then. Huh? Oh boy. That's not true. Wait, a amnesia's a stretch. We're probably just confused. I'm sure we'll remember eventually. No. Or it could be group hypnosis. Maybe brainwashing. <laughs> in any case, I hope we remember soon. That's a shame. Otherwise, I'll end up the outcast. The outcast? What do you mean? How should I put this? To tell you the truth, how I got here isn't the only thing I don't remember. I also forgot my own talent. What? You got it. Phew. I'm in trouble. I know I must have been some kind of ultimate. I just don't remember. Is that true? Of course it is. But then again, I don't blame you for not believing me. Oh, I never told you my name, did I? It's not like I already told you, but then I forgot I did, right? No, no you haven't told me your name yet. My name is Rantaro Ma. I can't remember my own talent at the moment, but I promise I'm not that. Nice to meet you. I need to put the voices on her. Rantaro Ma, the ultimate, I don't know. For someone who can't remember his old talent, he doesn't seem too shaken up about it. Actually, is it weird? That I'm not really bothered by the fact that I don't remember my talent. Huh? What? You know, I'm actually kind of looking forward to finding out 
I wonder what ultimate I am. Anyway, it'd be nice if we could get along. We aren't going anywhere for a while. Stop that. We'll escape soon. You really think it's gonna be that easy? Huh? What do you mean? Nothing. Just a feeling. <laughs> hey, don't worry about it, alright? Uh, I thought he would be a pretty chill guy to talk to, but... I have no idea what's going through his head right now. Oh, it is a whole lot of scoops. Repo, hello! Oh, let me grab a blanket, it's cold. Legs are. My feet always get cold. They're like the worst part of me. I was on like shuriken. Or so I'd be uh, rendered in anime. Hates those unacknowledged with the uh, hair. I like his big old lashes. Hello, Repo! Again. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like catching that. I don't like reading up on chat. I'm just like, so paid attention to this, I'm like, forgetting there's chat. <laughs> so I just look over every now and then, I'm sorry! He's strange though, Ron Taro. But I would le- <sighs> But I would at least like to remember my talent by the time we get out of here. Looks like we've got plenty of time. Oops, sorry. Shouldn't jinx it. Uh, you are suspicious. Let me just say that. You're suspicious. End of hallway. We'll look over here later. Why are there TVs here? Does she talk to me like that or log out on her? I'm confused. Is this a dining hall? A dining hall definitely makes this place feel more like school. But this place is called the Gold. Ugh, the ultimate academy for gifted juvenile denials. I can't speak. I doubt it's anything like a typical school. I can't speak. Oh my god. Okay. Huh? I'm yelling so I could build up my spirit energy. Don't you know you can unlock your brain's full potential by yelling to build up spirit energy? Ah, uh, I've heard that pro athlete suit. It's supposed to help you focus. I must be prepared for combat at all times, just in case someone tries to get it tries to attack me. I was about to say someone tried to kill me. I will protect myself from Mia Aikido. Aikido, whatever. Aikido, then you're. Oh yes. Oh, yes. Tenko Chabashira, ultimate Aikido master. Oh, I always imagined Akito Masters to be huge, burly guys, but you're so cute! <laughs> cute! No, oh, stop, stop it! I, uh, I'm not cute! My face crinkles when I suck down a shake, and when I wipe my face, my eyelids turn inside out! Uh, um, I see, but I think you're cute, right, Suichi? Uh, oh, oh, right. Huh? Uh, what's the matter? Your face looks really intense now. I don't like to be praised by degenerate males. Degenerate males? You mean men? Are you comfortable around them? Yes. It's a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable. If any degenerate tries to touch me, my reflex is to grab them and throw them across the room. And you're right, that is a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable around men. Hey. Uh, by the way... What is this Neo Aikido you mentioned? Right. Neo Aikido is an original form of Aikido that my master and I completely made up ourselves. So, your Aikido is all self taught. She hates men. <laughs> well, 
that's not what I wanted to do. Was it tell? Was it? I forgot how to open up the belt. But was it cute? God, I don't remember how to open up the book. That's not what I wanted to do. Was it N M P Q O O? Whoa! I can use E. I forgot how to do it. Hmm. Is it Q? No, no, that was fixing. Yeah. Yeah, Q resets the thing. 